Yeah, what's up? I'm back, man. You know what? Let's just, let's just think about it, man. Money. Money, right? It's an object. It's paper. You know what I'm saying? It's uh, something used to trade, right? Something used to trade, all right? This paper with faces on it, ink, words, you know what I'm saying? That they use to trade, right? Not only trade. They use it to confuse, manipulate, and control. Right? Because think about it. Everybody talk about you have to have this paper so that you can have a roof over your head. Right? So that you can have running water. You can turn your lights on and off. Right? can have air conditioning and heat, you know what I'm saying, you can cook your food, right, you have to have this paper, and you have to trade the paper in order to get these things, right, but think about it, think about it, just really think, right, it's fucking paper, right, and you're supposed to spend all these hours of your day to get fucking paper, right? <laughs> I mean, just sit with that for a moment, man. Really sit with that shit. A lot of people don't sit with shit, but they don't think about it. They don't, they don't sit with the, the actual thoughts that matter, man. Like, people so busy trying to, quote unquote, keep their head above water, right? Pay their bills, you know, do all these things, right? Make this paper. Get this paper. You know what I'm saying? Only to just waste hours and hours, countless hours of their days, right? Hmm. Waste countless hours of your day to pay for something that that's a roof over your head, that you're only there at the roof over your head for what several hours if that you know what I'm saying when you spend the majority of your day somewhere else to make the paper to get this right <laughs> make it make sense man for real shit don't make no damn sense shit don't make no fucking sense right When will the good people wake up and stop being slaves for paper? Being controlled by demons who <laughs> swing this paper over your head and say, Oh, come get it, come get it, come get the paper, come get the bag, <laughs> right? Work hard so you can play hard, right? Why? When are y'all gonna wake up and stop being a fucking slave? You're not. You're not really making any profit. No. No true profit. You're just getting paper with ink on it, bruh. You could buy a pack of paper at a store for a dollar, right? Drawing that motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Call it money if you want to. <laughs> Cause that's all it is. It's just fucking paper, bro. Like y'all tripping, man. Y'all tripping like a motherfucker. Y'all trade, y'all hard y'all, y'all time, your energy, which is really which is really more valuable than a fucking piece of paper. You really think about it. Your health, your your mental health. Your well-being, your happiness, your joy, your ability to move around, your ability to do things, to make things, to create, to actually really create. 
okay? That's what you could be doing with your time, creating, being joyful, actually doing something that matters. But instead, what are you, do, what are you doing? Being forced, being enslaved to go and, and swander off all your valuable, precious time, right? Your precious life force for an inanimate fucking object that's a piece of paper with some faces and words drew on the shit. Come on, man. Come on, man. Register that shit in your head, right? Before the paper was here, there was what? Gold and silver, right? The gold and silver was, you know, mined. They get it out of the ground. They get it out of caves or rock clusters and ores and all these different things, right? It's of the earth, right? It just grows there. It forms. So they get their machinery and they get it out of the earth. And then they tell you, you can't have it unless you are worthy (laughs) or you do something to get this gold and silver, right? You have to swander your time away. To get this gold that they got out of the ground, right? Or out of the ores or whatever. You you get me? That grows naturally. You get me? Come on, man. Did they tell you, you have to do this. Because you have to have this gold and you have to have this silver. What the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Creative minds. Use your creativity. Build your own fucking house. You know what I'm saying? Build the fucking house. You know what I'm saying? They tell you you have to pay this money to have this house. Why don't you just build your own damn house? You know what I'm saying? Why don't you why don't you make your own shit? Quit fucking quit fucking dealing with this bullshit, man. It's, it's straight up bullshit, really. Then these motherfucking demons try to tell you you can't have this land unless you pay for this land here and there and this and that. They claim they own it. Bitch, where? Where? Bitch, where? These demons don't own shit. Motherfuckers. For real. Mm. They come up with all these stupid, dumbass, retarded ass uh, rules of uh, liens and titles and all this stupid dumb mumbo jumbo bullshit right to take from the good people right the divine people your birthright (laughs) you know what I'm saying like for real all this land on this beautiful earth right these demons say it's theirs doesn't that sound familiar they always want what they, what ain't there is what don't fucking belong to them. The earth don't belong to these motherfuckers. Y'all need to quit letting these dumb motherfuckers think it belongs to them and it doesn't. Like for real. You know what I'm saying? True freedom is you should be able to go out. You see some land somewhere, ain't nothing there, ain't no house, nothing there. You could build your house right there and live in that motherfucker peacefully. You know what I'm saying? You built that motherfucker. Or if you can't build the house, you know somebody who can. Have them build it for you. And you do whatever you can do for that person, man. Like, she. Let's say you know how to cook clean. You know what I'm saying? You say, like, I don't know how to build the house, but I know how to cook and clean. I know how to I know how to garden. She. I know how to I know how to fucking farm. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? That, that's that's some real shit right there. Like, you don't fucking need all this stupid shit, bro. Like, these motherfuckers be... What? Come on, man. Y'all quit listening to these fucking demons, man. They don't know how to live. They don't know how to live righteously, man. Live righteously. You know what I'm saying? That's true living. You know what I'm saying? That's true freedom. You know what I'm saying? You you build your own house. You know what I'm saying? You, you, you do your own creative... Uh, abilities, you know what I'm saying? Not everybody can do the same shit. Not everybody want to do the same shit. They put y'all in these stupid ass groups and, and put labels and shit on you. Oh, oh, uh, this person is a cook. This person is a this and a that. 
You know what I'm saying? They want to label you in and box you in and shit. You know what I'm saying? Also, you can get some stupid ass paper. They label you, box you in, put you in these stupid ass boxes and these stupid ass groups and these stupid ass labels just so you could work your fucking life away for some fucking paper. You know what I'm saying? How many people out there are going to jobs that they don't eat? That's not their passion. They ain't passionate about that shit. They don't even want to be there. If they true passion is something completely different, but they can't do it because it ain't going to get them the paper that they, they've been manipulated to believe they need. You know what I'm saying? Break these stupid ass mind chains, man. They mind chain. They got people's minds chained up. Bind it up. Unbind that shit. I'm going to help you unbind that shit right now, man. Unbind all that bullshit, man. Get that shit out your head. You know what I'm saying? Do what the fuck you really love to do. You know what I'm saying? Take a fucking stand. Like, do what the fuck you really love to do. Tell me, motherfucker, fuck this job, man. I do what the fuck I want. I do what the fuck I want to do. You know what I'm saying? True fucking freedom, man. You ain't going to label me. You ain't going to put me in no stupid ass fucking box. You ain't going to box me in no fucking weird, bruh. Fuck that shit. Right? Shit. Fucking bullshit. That's what it is. This straight up bullshit. Well, y'all rise up and say, fuck that fucking paper, man. Fuck that stupid ass paper. And matter of fact, y'all need to y'all need to go ahead and put that gold and silver back into the the earth. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like for real. Uh, uh, like for real, man. What what's really what what really is the purpose? What's what's the fucking purpose of it? Ask that question, man. What's the purpose of this shit? It sound like a trap. It's a fucking trap to get you boxed in, bro. You gotta sit here, go through, go through all these hoops and all this bullshit to get some stupid ass paper, so you can buy some shit, right? That you supposedly need, right? And you may need it. Yeah, you may need a roof over your head. Yeah, true enough. But really think about the whole fucking steps you got to take just to get that fucking paper. That makes no fucking sense, bro. You got to do all this stupid shit just to get some fucking paper. Just so you can use that paper to get this. It's manipulation, bro. It's fucking manipulation. For real. For real. There's people out there can build. You can build your own damn house if, if you know how to do it. If you don't know how to do it, then you just got the the physical, you know what I'm saying, want to, to learn. You can learn that shit, bro. Learn. If you if you really want to do it, learn how to build the fucking house, bro. You know what I'm saying? Learn how to build the car. You can build your own fucking car. You know what I'm saying? Build your shit. You know what I'm saying? Then, but see, that's the thing. They get you trapped up because then you got to buy the materials, right? You got to buy the materials. Shit. You know what I'm saying? Then you can learn how to make the materials, but then you need some materials to make the materials. And then you still need the paper. See, they get you in this. They get you trapped up like that, right? Because really... I make it sound simple, like go build your house, right? But you need all the materials. You got to have the money to buy the materials. <laughs> See how they get you trapped, bro? It's all a fucking trap, bro. It's all a fucking trap. And then if you go out and you, you go chop down some trees, right, so you can build your a nice little wood house or whatever, they probably going to try to send some laws out to fuck with you. Oh, what are you doing? What are you you can't be cutting down these trees. You know what I'm saying? You see how they you see how they see how they try to pretend like they own shit? Like, bruh. Oh, so y'all can go cut down the trees and make us pay. But I can't go cut down my own trees and buy, build my own fucking house with it, right? Like for real? Are you serious right now? <laughs> see how see how they guys they they got people chat, bro. Open your fucking eyes, man. This shit is crazy, bro. Dude, they got the nerve in some places 
to try to find people or or uh you know scare them up from from fucking planting their own gardens you know what I'm saying oh what is this you're planting tomatoes and oh you want to plant your own food so you won't come to our stores and spin this paper and go slave away for this paper no 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 we can't have that this motherfucker boy look at this shit bro if y'all open y'all eyes man look at this shit it's obvious them demons bro them all demons only only a demonic mind comes up with that stupid shit we gonna make you have to do this you know what I'm saying? You 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 can't you can't uh you can't live you can't uh live that way. You have to be in our system. You have to be in our box. You know what I'm saying? Like you be in a box. You can't no, you can't grow your fucking tomatoes. No, you have to get in the box and join a demon program and then you have to come to our fucking grocery store and you have to spin the paper and you know I mean? <laughs> man, fuck that. Man, these motherfuckers stupid, bruh. That's stupid than a bitch, bro. Come on, man. Come on, man. Look at look at look at this shit, bro. You gotta <laughs> What you know, you don't have to do shit, bro, but they make you feel like you have to. Oh, you gotta come through this shit. You gotta jump through all these fucking hoops and circles and jump rope and hopscotch and you gotta <laughs> fucking bullshit. You gotta you gotta put up with this bullshit. For, for hours and hours of your fucking day, you got to put up with this shit. And then we might ration you out a little something. <laughs> but slavery, bro, that's slavery, bro. That's slavery like a bitch. Uh -huh. Slavery, bro. That's some slavery ass shit. That's some slavery ass shit. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm talking about life for real, man. They don't want you to build your own fucking house. They don't want, they don't want you to do that shit. They want you to be a fucking slave. That's some whole shit, bro. That's some straight up demonic shit. You know what I'm saying? That shit demonic than a motherfucker. I don't give a fuck. If anybody don't agree, fuck you. <laughs> you don't agree, fuck you, man. You a you a demon too, motherfucker. Fuck you. <laughs> Only demons agree with that stupid shit, man. Fuck that shit. That shit is demonic. Mm -mm. That shit demonic to the hoe. They don't want you to be independent. They want you to be a slave codependent. Motherfuckers, it's demon worshiping motherfucker. That's what the fuck they want. They want you to worship them and, and follow their regulations. <laughs> and I said it wrong on purpose. <laughs> so don't be in my comments talking about that. How you say that word? I know. I say it how I want to. They reg my nations with they bullshit, right? Fuck that shit. I don't put no respect on that shit. They shit don't get no respect from me. I don't praise them hoes. I don't praise no demon, man. They shit demonic. It's wicked. That shit wicked. It's evil. You know what I'm saying? Slavery evil than a bitch. You know what I'm saying? Making motherfuckers do shit against their will. That's evil as fuck, bro. Like, don't nobody that's really truly, uh, you know what I'm saying, want to be independent in a you know, a good natured person want to be slaved around going somewhere they don't want to go for hours on end. You know what I'm saying? That's slavery, bro. You got motherfuckers out here slaving. Like, that's some stupid shit. Fuck that stupid shit. And then most of these places they got you slaving at not only you got to spend all your time there, they be having shitty motherfuckers in there with you. You know what I'm saying? Motherfucking other demons fucking with you, harassing you while you trying to get the paper. <laughs> you getting harassed by demons at the same damn time, right? Motherfuckers just fucking with you, man. Bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Straight up bullshit. You got to deal with they wicked ass, retarded ass personalities. You know what I'm saying? Then you got, you, you, 
you also stressed out because you got bills to pay. You got you got mortgages. You got mouths to feed at home. You got all this shit pounding up. And you just like, damn, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Then I got to deal with motherfucker bad attitude Bobby and bad attitude Willie and bad attitude Megan and bad attitude Rebecca. You got to deal with the motherfucker bad attitudes up in that motherfucker that fucking with you every time you come in that bitch. And you got to come in that bitch at least five days a week. You know what I'm saying? And that's if you're lucky. Sometimes these motherfucking jobs, they won't keep you there all fucking week long. You be in that motherfucker seven days a week, six days a week like a bitch. Every day. Every day. Every day. You gotta go be a slave and, and put up with them wicked motherfuckers. What the fuck? That's demonic than a hoe, bro. You can't tell me that shit ain't demonic. You can't tell me. I'm lying. I'm telling the truth. Shit. I'm telling the truth, man. I'm telling the truth. You know what I'm saying? You, you got... Come on, man. Come on, man. Then, then they come up with their little badges and their costumes. Like I said, you you making you a motherfucking garden. You know what I'm saying? And you, you, you making you some damn, uh, you know... You cook, making you some fruits and vegetables and shit in your garden, right? You growing you some food, right? You motherfucker want to trip on you, bro. Yo, you what you doing? You ain't coming there with their costumes and shit. You, you know, you violating code 221, do, do, bop, beep, up, do. <laughs> they, they read you these stupid ass numbers talking about what code you can violate it. Bitch, you violate these nuts, motherfucker. What the fuck? Get your <laughs> get your costume party face ass the fuck off my property. That what y'all need to be telling these motherfuckers. Get your costume party ass off my property. She, I build me a fucking tomato if I want them. If I want to, motherfucker. And yeah, I said build, but grow, build, grow. It's the same damn thing. You put the seed in the ground and you do the building. You know what I'm saying? You got to make sure you got all the right conditions, right? So, you you, you know what I'm you putting your work into this. You know what I'm saying? You're doing something you want to do, right? And it feel good to you because it's something you want to do, right? Like, damn, you know what I'm saying? Look at me. I'm making progress. You know, you go out there. You see you see how much it's growing and you getting all happy. you like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I'm doing a great job. You know what I'm saying? But then they want to come with their costumes and ruin ruin your party. You know, they weren't even invited to your party. They weren't invited to your house. But they think because they got this costume and their stupid ass regularizations with the codes <laughs> that they fucking wrote up, right? They wrote up these stupid ass codes. Okay, then these motherfuckers won't come to your shit. <laughs> with some stupid ass code books that they wrote. <laughs> Come on, man. Make that shit make some sense. That shit is retarded and demonic. <clears throat> Motherfucker, you weren't invited here. Fuck your codes. You know what I'm saying? Stick those violations up your ass. All right? Me and my tomato over here having a good fucking time. You know what I'm saying? I make me a good salad when it's when it's done. All right, motherfucker? You know what I'm saying? I got some cap. I got me some, uh, not cabbage, but some, uh, lettuce. You know what I'm saying? Growing that right beside it, motherfucker, for making me a salad. You know what I'm saying? And you go mind your damn business with your uniform, your motherfucking costume party, motherfucker. <laughs> I'm tired of these motherfuckers. Look at here. Look at here. Look at here, motherfucker. <laughs> Y'all need to get on these hoes, man. Fuck them. They stupid than a bitch, bro. You think anybody in their right mind that's actually a real human that ain't a demon that's actually a real good person and a, a divine person that's real right is gonna sit back and decide oh let me open this book and write down some codes and just say oh people is violating it so they have to give me uh uh, uh they have to stop doing what the fuck they doing or give me their money or uh, uh, not even their money because at this time at this, we don't need no fucking money bro you don't need no fucking paper bro it's like, like retarded that's another fucking regularization that they created, bro. Like, what the fuck? Nigga, fuck that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, for real. <laughs> like, on, on everything, fuck that shit. 
Like, what the fuck? Come on, man. Come on, man. Make it make sense, bro. It don't make sense. It ain't meant to because it's manipulation. It's fucking... That shit is a fucking hypnotic spell. You know what I'm saying? A demonic hypnotic spell. That's what the fuck it is. They sit down, got their fucking books out, and start writing this stupid shit. Yeah, how can we how can we enslave these people? I know. Anytime they're doing something that's actually good for them, we'll say it's a violation. Oh, they're oh what? What? Oh, they're growing food to eat? Healthy food that's good for them? Oh no, that's we have to stop them from doing that. Oh, they can't just be over there willy-nilly being all healthy and happy over there, growing their food. Oh, no, we have to end that right now. We have to call that violation, okay? We're going to call this violation code up 102, no grow your own fruits and vegetables, Okay, well, so we write that down. Okay, write that down. I'm gonna, look, I'm gonna sign my name beside it, so that mean that it's it's law. It's the law. They can't break it. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. Oh, oh, what's that? What's that you said? Who's up there? Who's up there? Was that Martin over there cutting down trees? He says he's going to build him a house. What? What? Hey, what? Are you? No, we, we have to we have to put it into that. We can't have him out here building the house for himself. No, we can't. We, no. No. He has to be a, he has to live on the streets. He has to live on the streets so he has to come and be our slave so that then he can have a house. You know, he no way he can go out there and do that himself. You know what I'm saying? No, these motherfuckers, I'ma tell you right now, man. These motherfuckers is stupid than a bitch, bro. These motherfuckers stupid than a bitch, bro. Like, for real, man. What the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Oh, what, what's, who's, who's that over there? You said Mary's over there cooking food. And, and what? She's cooking food and she's she's giving it to people? She's giving it to people and what that? What? What? They're helping her. Oh, they're helping her? Oh no, we gotta put a stop to that. No, 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 no. They're they're giving her our paper money. Oh no, they're giving her paper money. And she's giving them place of food. Oh no, no, no. We have to write violation code. Violation code. We'll call it uh cooking without a permit. <laughs> cooking without a permit. That's what we're gonna call it. Violation code 221, cooking without a permit. You know what I'm saying? That's what we gonna call it. So we gotta go over there and put a stop to that because that just that's just too good. She's doing too good for herself over there. We have to put a stop to that, okay? No, 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 no. We can't have that in, in our demonic codes. Okay, well, they have to stick to the codes and be our slaves and do what the fuck we say, right? They want y'all to obey these motherfuckers, like, for real. Y'all, y'all need to wake the fuck up, man. Quit obeying these hoes. Obey them for what, bitch? Bitch? I don't know. I ain't obeying none of you motherfuckers. You. Fuck you, motherfucker. Shit, bitch. Fucking build me an apple tree in my yard, ho. Fuck you. Fuck you talking about. And if you come out here trying to cut down my apple tree, bitch, you gonna get your ass cut down. Shit. Touch my damn apple tree. You stay off my property, motherfucker. With your costume uniform. Bitch, I'm gonna be a, be an apple tree, yo. Right here in the front yard, bitch. <laughs> Shit, I want me some, want me some apples, motherfucker. Fuck you, bitch. Build, build me a fucking orange tree right beside that hoe, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Fuck it. You know what I'm talking about? These motherfuckers on some bullshit. Straight up. Straight up, bro. Build my house. My apple tree. You know what I'm saying? Build me some peaches and some oranges and some everything. You know what I'm saying? Them motherfuckers better not come on my fucking property. You know what I'm talking about? Motherfucker, talking about. They gonna be talking about 
who owns this property, bitch me? Well, where is where is your paperwork? I'ma go inside, I'ma fucking draw up a paper, just like they draw up papers, motherfucker. I'ma do my shit with f- color markers, bitch. My paper gonna be prettier than y'all's, ho. <laughs> I'ma use color markers on my shit, nigga. Put some stickers around that bitch, some smiley faces on that hoe, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> say, see, this ain't, I own this property, bitch, and this land, motherfucker. Fuck y'all. <laughs> That's what it's gonna say on that, too. That shit gonna say, fuck y'all. Costume party, motherfuckers. That's what my, that's what my motherfucking property ownership title gonna say. It's gonna say, fuck you, costume wearing motherfuckers. I own this shit right here, bitch. I built this house on this motherfucking land. I'm on motherfucker right now, bitch. That part. <laughs> These motherfuckers stupid, bro. Fucking bullshit. Y'all motherfuckers. Man, fuck that shit. Fuck all that shit. These motherfuckers stupid in a bitch, bro. Violating codes and bullshit. Man, fuck your codes, nigga. I take your code book and toss that bitch in the bottom of the ocean, motherfucker. <laughs> Bitch, I toss that motherfucker. I toss that motherfucker out the earth. <laughs> that's how that's how mad I am at these hoes, bro. I toss that bitch out the earth, bitch. I kick that hoe so hard, that motherfucking cold book will fly out the earth, motherfucker. Like, bitch, get this shit out of here. Oh, lame ass rule book bullshit. Got a little dust on my phone, my bad. But anyway. <clears throat> I'ma tell y'all, man. Fuck that. <laughs> Fuck that, man. Fuck that demonic shit. You know. Yeah. Just really think about that shit, though, for real. Yeah, man. They got they got people doing all this shit. It's really slavery, man. That shit slavery. I didn't heard so many people tell me they hate their fucking job, bro. But they they feel like they gotta go. They have to go there. They got to do it. It's like what the fuck, motherfuckers be going to work sick and shit. Motherfuckers be what the fuck, ah, man. Look at her. Look at her, man. Say no to slavery. Alright. I didn't heard it said. Say no to drugs. Say no to slavery, man. Say no, bitch. No. I will not be your slave. No. That's not what we're doing here. Ain't no way. Ain't no motherfucking way. You know what I'm saying? Get tossed that fucking shit. Slavery should never have existed to begin with. Never. It should have never been in existence. You know? Like, for real, man. People take your sovereignty, man. Take your independence. You know what I'm saying? Don't be codependent on these demons, man. Like, they, they ain't shit. They ain't shit. Slave ass bullshit. That's all it is, man. I'm telling the truth. Yeah, that's the truth. All this stupid ass shit. They just wanna just let you just waste away in they bullshit. Like I said, you just going in these places, doing these things you don't even really want to be there. You don't even want to be there. It's like what the fuck. You know what I'm saying? To pay for your house, your cars, your food, your clothes, your this, your that. Right? And do you even really have time to really enjoy the stuff that you get? Because most of your time is at the place you don't want to be. So it's like you at the place you don't want to be to pay for the life you, you want, but you can't even enjoy the fucking life that you're paying for. Like, that's some... What the fuck? 
Or if you can enjoy it, it's only a fraction. It's only a little fraction. You give it like 90% of your whole fucking energy and life force to them when you only get 10% back. Like, you just, <laughs> what the fuck, bro? Make it make sense. It don't make sense. And the only ones who really get to really enjoy all of this quote-unquote things that seem so extravagant are the demons, you know? Because they're working y'all, taking y'all's money, you know what I'm saying? Living rich off y'all, you know what I'm saying? Like, y'all put in all the work and they just bullshit, you know what I'm saying? That they, these, these motherfucking demons, they seem to be enjoying themselves. They got so much time on their hands that they're able, they're able to devise plans to murder and kill and harm and manipulate. They got so much time on their hands because they ain't fucking really, they ain't working like y'all working. They working on something completely different. While they got y'all distracted, slaving away, right? They're making you sick. They're, they're killing you. They're, they're doing all these twisted, evil shit. You know what I'm saying? That's what the fuck they're doing. Right? While you at work, they getting in their airplanes and they spraying poison in the fucking sky. Right? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They, they spraying fucking poisons in the fucking sky and shit. They out here putting on their costumes to give people fucking cold violations. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? They out here just causing all kind of bullshit. While y'all out slaving the fuck away. Y'all too busy slaving to actually pay attention to the other wicked shit that they're fucking doing to you. Right? Then they have a nerve to, you know what I'm saying, have, have some of y'all building y'all own fucking, pretty much building y'all own fucking death traps, man. They have you slaving away building your own death trap. Like, that's fucked up. You know what I'm saying? I take it to this analogy. It's like having a motherfucker take you out, say, dig this hole. You out there digging. As soon as you get done, they throw you in that motherfucker. And, and cover it up, right? Like, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Y'all literally, that's what these motherfuckers is doing. Oh, that's just an analogy, but that's what the fuck they doing, bro. Like, yo. Bullshit. Straight up. Bullshit is what it is. So when y'all gonna say no to slavery, like y'all say no to drugs, and even more so, you know what I'm saying? No to slavery, man. Slavery is one of the biggest drugs out there. You got so many people addicted to slavery, they don't want to let it go. They feel like they have to have it, right? That's the same thing with drugs. You feel like you have to have it. You need it. We need motherfucking slavery rehab, bro. Like, for real. Like, right now, man, people need to get off of this addiction to slavery, bro. Break that super bad habit. Because it's super bad. It's super bad. It takes so much out of you. And it don't hardly give you shit back. Crumbs. You know what I'm saying? They give you fucking crumbs, bro. That's bullshit. That's straight up bullshit. Make it. Make it. <laughs> I'm making it make all the sense, man. I'm telling you the truth. I'm painting a clear fucking picture. It's so fucking clear. It's so fucking accurate. You know what I'm saying? Like... It's right there. Ain't no fucking box there. 
it's free, it's open, you know what I'm saying, it ain't got you all hunkered down on no stupid shit, you know what I'm saying, independence is a beautiful thing, you know what I'm saying, it's divine, it's true, it's freedom, you know what I'm saying, like, for real. True harmony, true harmony. What I can't do, my fellow divine brother and sister can do, and what they can't do, I can do. You see how that that harmonizes? It's just like music. You know what I'm saying? You got somebody who can play the saxophone. You got somebody who can play the drums. You got somebody who can play the flute. You got somebody who can play the trombone. You put it all together, it's beautiful music. That's harmony. You know what I'm saying? Let me paint another picture for you. Like I was I said this analogy before. You got somebody who can build the house. You got somebody who can build the car. You got somebody who can tend to the farm. You got somebody who can lay the foundation. You got somebody who can make the roof of the house. You got somebody who can, you know what I'm saying, tend to the kids. You know, teach them. You know what I'm saying? You got somebody who can tend to the sick. You got somebody who can create art in one aspect or another. You got another person who can create art in some aspect or another. You know what I'm saying? And really, if you think about it, it's our art. You know? Growing that garden is art. Building that house is art. It's all it's all art. It's all creativity. You know what I'm saying? It's harmony. It's fucking harmony. It's simple. Shit. Even the birds do it. Even the animals do it. You know what I'm saying? They depend on each other. That's harmony. That's freedom. That's independence. You know what I'm saying? Like for real. That's, that's the truth. That's true independence. That's freedom right there. Take your freedom. Definitely. Take all freedom. Because that's what it is, man. It's freedom. It's life. It's abundance. It's divine. It's harmony. It's the truth. So fuck these fucking costume party ass motherfuckers, man. These motherfucking masquerading ass bitches. You know what I'm saying? With they regularizations and they qualifications, <laughs> qualifications. <laughs> I would say that one right, but still, look. It's like if you want your freedom you have to do the things that that get your freedom right without fear you know what I'm saying you gotta have that conquering spirit that courage you know what I'm saying yeah Definitely that motivation. And that want to fucking quit that drug called slavery, man. Say no to drugs. Say no to slavery. Like for real. Just say no. No. No drugs. No slavery. You know what I'm saying? Pure. Divine. Harmony. Freedom. Independence. You know what I'm saying? For real. Because that is divine and that is true. And that is the divine and good people's birthright. That's our birthright.
and that reigns true throughout all of life. All right, that reigns true throughout all of life, and anything that's against that is just not the truth. It's demonic. It's evil. It's wicked. Slavery is wicked. It's wicked. All right. You shouldn't have to be forced or manipulated or cohorced into doing things you don't want to do. You're not benefiting in no positive, real positive way. You know what I'm saying? You, that system is not, that slavery system is not beneficial. It's just not, it's not, it's not in harmony. You know what I'm saying? It's like a wobbly tire, man. That shit is not in harmony. It's not balanced. It's not correct. That shit is whack. It gotta go, man. That shit whack as fuck. Drugs are whack. Slavery is whack. <laughs> For real. That shit whack, man. Yeah, <laughs> telling the truth, man. But anyway, I think I'm about done with this beautiful divine discussion, right? You know what I'm saying? I think I'm going to go ahead and sign off. Superstar Kiki signing out this thing. You feel me? <laughs>